Yo, boys, good morning, guys. Welcome back to another brand new video. And in this one, we'll be checking out this mini update that just came out inside of Anime Islands. I'm super, super hyped about this update because they just added dungeons, which is gonna be quite insane. But if you haven't already and do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a quick like, come subscribe, and join my Discord server in the description below. Over 97% of you guys are not subscribed and it is free and does help out the channel. So I really really appreciate it. And now let's get started. Right, awesome. So firstly we got a new code right here. So it is update 2.5. There we go. And successfully redeemed. I think that gave us a bunch of boosts. Here in the soul world, which is the soul city. And here we are. We got this NPC right here. Let's talk to her. And I'm guessing this is the shop. So we need 2,000 to get the sword. I'll get a random sword 13, 14, and 15 times. That's probably the best sword in game right now. Then we can buy potions from her, which is really, really cool. We can also buy these stones, the orc tooth, and the goblin ear. And now they really put the detail on the ear. Kind of, kind of looks weird, but no worries. So let's go through this portal in dungeons, and here we are. So you can select which dungeon you want to go in. Either the medium one, the hard one, and the easy one, I'm guessing. I give this come over here. And... Okay, so, you can see an opening here in 25 minutes. And once this opening opens, you can go to either one of those dungeons. And once you're in there, and look at this, it actually moves where I look. That's actually pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, back to what I was saying. Once this dungeon opens up, we can go inside whichever difficulty we want. And there, I think we have we'll have to like defeat enemies or so on. So um yeah, before that starts, let's go ahead and max out everything new. I don't want to max out my rank or like rank up right now, but let's just see the multiplier. Okay, 17 times, but I won't do that just yet because I'm quite quite powerful. I'm not gonna lie, and it'll take a while to get that back. So we first do the dungeons before I rank up. But let's buy all these upgrades with our gems. 1 QA and 1 QA, okay, so there's one new level for power, gems, and sword. And yeah, that's pretty, pretty cool. Ready, we got 6 minutes, 30 more seconds, so I'll see you guys once it's like 6, 30 seconds. And um, yeah, see you in a minute. We got 15 seconds left, let's just come over here for the easy dungeon. And we also got a new code, which let's use right now. It's called, um, sorry for shutdown bug, I'm guessing there was a bug. Let's use that. Yeah, sorry for dungeon bug. And there we go. Let's claim that. And it works, okay. So it's teleporting us in 1 minute and 17 seconds now. And I'm guessing you just line up here where we wanna go. Once that cooldown comes down every 30 minutes, um, this cooldown pops up for 2 minutes. And right after that, we get into the dungeon. So, I heard that the medium and hard dungeon was a bit too hard for me. As I'm not the strongest there is right now. I am pretty strong, but not that strong. So, let's do the easy dungeon for now and see how it goes. Alright, here we go. Last time it messed up and it bugged. But this time we're finally here. So, this is like a raid. We got 15 minutes to complete this. 45 enemies and they have 100 trillion health. And it's not quite a lot for me, actually. And I can put on my Grimoire for my damage. And there we go. Also got my hero in here. Let's put the damage Grimoire on him as well. And there we go. So let's just like quickly clear through this. And we're actually getting drops as well. So if you just check over here to items. We got goblin ears. And we also got these crystals over here. So collect them holding E. And let's see what we get after collecting them. And we got five of these pink crystals. Stone tier 2. Alright so apparently there are these different crystals around here. And you can collect them. And there's different tiers of enemies. So these ones that were just right when you spawn in. Uh, the tier 1s, like I just defeated goblin tier 1s and later on there will be goblin tier 3s and more on and we also got this green crystal over here stone tier 1 so you get these goblin ears by um, defeating these goblins and you need to claim all of these crystals around the dungeon to get these um, stone crystals or stone tiers and I believe you only need one hit on these NPCs so even if you're weak you can just hit them once and if anyone else defeats them like you're getting carried, then you should get the rewards as well. And that's pretty, pretty cool. And we got a blue crystal right here. Let's see what tier it is. And if we check, it is stone tier 3. And here are the next NPCs. We got the orc 1. And let's see what they give us. And they give us the teeth. Okay, it's the orc tooth.
And boom, there we go. So this is the last NPC we have left. The dungeon boss. It is the old boss. And as you can see, enemy is 1 out of 45. 6 minutes and 30 seconds left. Now after defeating him, we got this chest. And upon opening it, we got... A bunch of these magic feathers and some cursed energy. And I think that gave me like 1000 magic feathers and like 500 cursed energy. But I'm not quite sure. But after you defeat the boss, also in the anime, the dungeon closes down so we can just leave now because it's pretty much over. And if we come back to the shop now, let's talk to this NPC and we didn't get these coins. I'm not quite sure how we get those, but we also have these. We can sell them for money. And okay, so we get these coins by selling these things and we can sell them all for money. So let's sell them all right there. And we made 526 of these dungeon coins. And we need like 2000 of them to get this random sword. And um, yeah, that's pretty, pretty insane. Dragon Sphere actually also spawned an alien planet. So let's just quickly get that. As I kind of need those, I, um, I'm looking for upgrading my team. And I got um, these two pets. Yeah, these two pets, the Goku Black and the Shanks. Which are pretty, pretty weak, I'm not gonna lie. And his Dragon Ball, let's get that. And it's number 5. Yeah, we actually needed that one. And obviously, I'm guessing that the higher dungeon you go, the more rewards you'll get. And then you can sell them for more dungeon coins. I uh, suppose hard will get the most. But um, medium is really, really hard right now as well, even for leaderboard players. So that's going to be quite a while before we do that. But we can easily solo easy raid on the bright side. And it gives a bunch of coins. Alright, so we have Yori over here and he has 1 trillion power. Which is quite a lot, I'm not gonna lie. And with him, we're gonna do the medium dungeon and see if we can beat it. And hopefully we can because I wanna see how much it gives us. But we gotta wait two more minutes. So let's quickly do that and I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright, here we are. So I'm guessing it's the same map and the same NPCs. But as you can see, 2.5 QA and they have a bunch of health. So testing my um, theory out from before. Let's just see like once um, he finishes these NPCs we actually do get credit for our damage all right so we're in a third dungeon now and we need one more after this and then we can finally buy the new weapon and see how good it looks and how overpowered it is here's a quick time lapse of completing this dungeon i'll see you guys in a minute And okay, so the boss is down, here's the chest, and from that we got a bunch of stuff. Yeah, we're at 2k feathers now, and we also got a bunch of these tooth, the goblin ears, and a bunch of these stones as well. Awesome, so if we come back over here to the merchant, let's come over here and sell all our stuff. Sell that for 330, 134, 105, 50, and 263, and we got 1.8k. And if we hadn't disconnected that time, we would have had enough. But that's alright because we can do one more dungeon after this. And then hopefully we'll be able to get one of those 14 or 15 times. I really don't want the 13 times because I don't really need that much. But um, yeah, let's see what we can get. And there we go. Last boss we needed. We got the chest right here. There we go. And now we can leave this dungeon and we can finally buy our first weapon. I'm really really excited about this. Let's come over here. Talk to her. Let's firstly sell all our stuff. We made a lot of money this time as well. There we go. 2.7k. You can buy this random sword for 2,000. Let's do it in 3, 2, 1. Boom. There we go. So we got the Dark Repulsor. Okay. Awesome. So if we check over here. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, um, and here it is. Let's stop clicking and look at that it actually looks really really cool yeah it's super super clean and we can come over here to curl school and we can put a good enchantment on him or uh, on the sword actually and i have like 3000 enchantment points so let's talk to marky over here put that in let's find it and we actually have to unequip that first um yeah there we go let's talk to her again accept put that in third tier enchant for 3000 curse energy 
and there we go and there we go it's as good as the best world um sword okay so that is the worst sword in the merchant but that's the best sword that i have now and it's better than all the world boss swords i'm guessing and if we equip best and there we go so that's a new combo right here you can also add this sword to my um hero and he's doing 4.8 trillion damage now wow that's absolutely insane and yeah i really really like this mini update this isn't even the main update and that's going to come out later on so super super hyped about that and um, this update is really good to increase your damage as the swords are so easy to get plus you can also get pretty much infinite boost which is kind of insane but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and this video helped you out if you did please leave a like and subscribe below i really really appreciate it and thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace